It was a joyous moment, the culmination of years of work by scientists at the European Space Agency. There were celebrations, the instant a robot probe landed on a comet half a billion kilometres from Earth. But after the high, some concerns. A problem with the anchoring system may hamper the project. Photos taken of the comet by the lander called Filey and the mothership known as Rosetta show it functioning during its descent. But the probe may have actually bounced on the comet's surface, in effect landing twice. The reason? Harpoons which failed to fire were needed to anchor the virtually weightless lander safely onto the comet's surface. Even so, there's optimism it will be able to carry out the planned investigations into the origins of Earth and the solar system. I'm proud of all the people that, that work on this mission. This is a true indication of what we can do internationally, what international collaboration can do, not only in Europe but across the world. And what is the last message of Matt Taylor to Philae? Well done, you got there. Now start doing some science for us and uh, we'll be in touch. Our reporter at Mission Control in Germany says... What happened on November the 12th, some 500 million kilometres from Earth, is something special. A small leap into the icy void for the lander, but a great jump forward in scientific knowledge. The ESA team has won, but now it's up to the probe to remove the veil from one of the biggest ever mysteries about the origins of the universe.